Hello everybody, this is Marcos with Halcyon Technologies. Welcome to another video tutorial. In this video, I will be showing you guys how to download and install the Hike Vision Client for Mac. If you guys are using Windows, please see our video description down below. Or the Again, this is for Mac. Let's go ahead and get to it, shall we? So the first thing we're going to go ahead and do, we're going to open our web browser. And then within our web browser, we're going to go ahead and search for IVMS 4200. And then we're going to go into the link that says Client Software Download High Vision. From there, we're going to go ahead and scroll down and look for the Mac version. It is the only link that says for Mac. In this case, it's the version 2.0. We're going to go ahead and click on it, scroll down and select the download link right there and select agree on the turn to service once our download is complete we're going to go ahead and open our pkg file if we get this error message uh, it's 100 percent normal apple just likes blocking all applications we're going to go ahead and open our system preferences go into security and privacy and it's going to be in the first page. It's going to say IVMS 4200. We're going to click on Open Anyway. Here, our installation window will come up. Hit Continue. Select our storage location and then select Continue one more time. And hit Install. And then, when prompted, we're going to go ahead and enter our credentials. And hit Install. Okay, once our install is complete, we can go ahead and minimize the privacy tab. And then we're going to go ahead and open our application, which is going to be located under Finder, Applications. And it's the icon that looks and says IVMS 4200. Double click on that. Upon initial setup, we're going to be prompted to create a super user. This could be whatever you guys desire. These are just credentials for the client. In this case, I'm going to make a tutorial one and a very weak password and select auto login. So the next time I open up the software, it will bypass this information for me and automatically log me. Hit register. Okay, once our uh, program is up, we're going to go ahead and log in to view our cameras. So first. We're going to go into device management, go into cloud P2P, make sure the region is in USA, and then hit login. Now, these credentials are the credentials for your Hike Connect account, not the super user we just created. Again, this is your Hike Connect account, and the ones you use for your mobile devices. That is the the credentials you will be entering in this tab. But once we have that information, we're going to go ahead and select login and it will load all the DVRs associated to our accounts. So let's go back to control panel and we're going to go into main view which is live view. They just call it main view. As we can see our cameras are grouped up into one folder. We can other either double click the folder itself or double click one camera in this case I will double click one camera I don't want all the cameras up if the program is second to load and our video will our camera will load if you guys have any questions feel free to reach out our information is in the in the description box down below thanks and have a wonderful day